welcome back to another video. If you're new here, my name's Donna. I'm a mum of two boys and I share mainly foodie content on my channel. So I do a grocery haul and a meals of the week video every week and there's some extras in there as well. So don't forget to check out all of my playlists and stuff. There's lots of content there that will hopefully give you some meal inspiration and some money saving tips for your family. Um, I'm also on Instagram, so I'll leave my Instagram handle here if you want to go and head over and um, follow me over there as well. But today I've got an Ocado shop to share with you. Like I mentioned, I'm trying to keep our groceries well under £100 um, each week just to, you know, save a bit of money. It seems like on uh, obviously the prices are going up, but some tips and tricks to just kind of save a bit of money on the food. So I had a £15 voucher off, so this came to £85, which was good. Um, so yeah, we've got some meal stuff in there and also some sort of snacky bits for um, some play dates over the Easter holidays. And I will be using up a few bits from the cupboards and the freezers as well. Um, so yeah, pleased with what I got for the money. So I'll spin you around and show you what I grabbed from Ocado. Um, all of the prices will be on the screen for you and then at the end I will share with you the meal plan. Okay, so as always I'll start with the fruit and veg. So I've got one of the bunches of ripen at home bananas so that they last a little bit longer and then a pack of the five ready to eat bananas um, because we are completely out so got some so that we can eat them straight away and then I've got a punnet of strawberries they look quite nice quite big so that's good got those um, I've got some plums for a change it's probably only me um, that will eat these but I do like them so I got some of those for a bit of a change um, we've still got some apples left in the fridge to use up and some grapes and um, a, a one kiwi I think so um, we'll use all those up this week as well and then I also got um, some blood oranges for Yanis to take to work he likes these big oranges he just cuts them up um, and they had blood oranges on um, the flash deal so I thought for a change um, I'm sure they're really really tasty I'll try one as well I've never had blood oranges before um, so yeah we'll give those a go and then the veg, again, I'm going to use up a bit of what I've got. So I have got a usual head of broccoli. Um, I've got some carrots still in the fridge. And I've got some green beans and some peas and sweet corn in the freezer. So I'm going to use up some of those. Um, I've got a big bag of potatoes. I've got a usual cucumber. And I do have some lettuce left in the fridge to use. Um, and a pack of the red peppers. Um, and again, I do have a couple of other um, peppers in there. So just got those. I'm going to use those all up in some dinners this week. And then the other chilled bits, I've got our usual four pint of blue milk. Got Yanis his Greek yogurt that he has for breakfast. I've got another clover light because I'm nearly out. And then these were on an offer. I think it was three for eight pounds. Um, so one day for dinner, we're going to have like um, chicken, salad, flatbreads, olives um feta and um i've got some tzatziki here as well so we're gonna have a bit of a greek kind of chicken flatbread kind of affair so i've got the tzatziki and then these were on the offer so we've got um olives with garlic pimento and jalapeno and then um got some wafer thin british ham on the offer as well just for sandwiches that looks really nice um and then also some cocktail sausage rolls the boys have got some friends coming over a couple of days for play dates so um i have got like some pizza and bits um for that so i got those on the offer and then i'm going to make some homemade chicken burgers and yanis likes cheese in here so i've got some of these burger cheese slices um i've got some cheese strings henry really likes those he has like a we call it a picky plate so he'll have like uh, maybe one of these like some ham cucumber carrot sticks some crisps some bits and bobs um on a plate and um for lunch so i got those and then we've got our usual extra mature cheese that we get every week and then the meat um i ordered these i actually thought they were boneless um but they're skinless almost um so 
you get a kilogram and I think they were 475 so they're still really good value so I will either take the bone out if I'm using them for curries or whatever or I will do it like a bit of a tray bake and like when we have the Greek um, chicken I'll probably just cook it with the bone in and then just shred the meat off um, so they were really good value 475 for a kilogram but obviously not all of it is meat because you've got the bones in there so um, but yeah still good value so I got those got a lean beef mince and a beef roasting joint for our Sunday roast and then in the freezer I've got some fish that I'm going to use up and I've got um, I think four or five chicken breasts that I'm going to use up as well so um, those and what we've already got will do us through the week so that was quite good I only needed a few bits there um, and then I've also got one of these big M&S cheese and tomato pizzas. I've got some pepperoni in the fridge because um, I did some pita pizzas the other day for lunch. Um, so what I thought was if I'll put, probably put pepperoni on half of it and then um, I'll leave the other half as cheese. And then if people like cheese pizza, they can have the cheese bit. And if they like pepperoni, they can do the pepperoni bit. Um, so I'll do that when the boys have friends over. Um, and then the cupboardy bits, I've got some panko breadcrumbs. Um, like I mentioned, I'm going to do some homemade chicken burgers. A bit like I did the schnitzels um, the other week. I'm going to do those, um, but have them in buns and have them as burgers. I think that'll be really tasty. Um, and I picked up one of these. This M&S chicken seasoning is really nice. Um, and I thought, since I was ordering from Ocado, I would... Um, focus um so you can see it's like paprika yeast onion garlic that kind of thing but it's really tasty goes in anything so i've got one of those i've got some more honey to go in the yogurt and various other recipes i've got one of these these were on offer it's a new one um like an intro offer so we're gonna have bolognese one day and i thought i would just use one of these and i don't think where's the ingredients yeah, it's mainly, look, just literally tomato, olive oil, onion, carrot. So, yeah, I thought I would get one of those um, for our bolognese. And then I've got two of these little custard pots. We're going to have strudel and um, the tins weren't on offer, but these were on offer for a pound. So I got those. It's only me and Yanis that have custard with ours. Archie likes his plain and Henry doesn't like it. So um, we'll have those. And then I've got some coconut milk and I've got these sachets were on an offer for for something. So I'm not going to use all of them this week, but they were a really good deal. So I've got the, um, I can't pronounce that, but coconut curry. So that's what the coconut milk is for. And then there's a honey chilli chicken one, which um, none of them, you need too many ingredients. So ketchup, honey and water. I'm not going to use chicken wings. I'll probably use the chicken thighs. Um, and then I'm going to use this one for our Greek chicken, so chicken gyros, um, and you just need like your flatbreads, your tzatziki, which I've got, chicken breast or thighs, so do that. And then I've also got this one, a Bella Italia, um, creamy chicken and mushroom pasta, so one week I'll do that. And again, you don't need very much, just chicken, mushrooms, and then milk to make your sauce up and your pasta so they look really tasty and really quick and easy so they were on and off a four for something um and then juice wise i've got a vimto and a mediterranean orange got a nine pack of toilet rolls because we need toilet rolls um and then i've also got some free range eggs there's 15 there because i am completely out now um, and then some snacky bits. So again, for like friends coming over, I've got some sweet popcorn. And then I've got some of the double cream Oreos. They were on offer for 99p, I think. And then these were on offer two for something. So I've got party rings and jemmy dodgers. And then this mini eggs chocolate. Yanis and I were going to get ourselves one of the big inclusions eggs for Easter um, to share. And I never got round to getting one. And then they were sold out. So... Um, this was half price um, at Ocado, £2.25, I think, and it's one of the huge bars. So I thought I would get that as a bit of a belated Easter treat for us. So we'll share that um, over the next few days. So I was going to say week, but that would be a bit ambitious. So we'll share that. 
Um, and then the bakery bit, I've got a 50-50 Warburton's loaf. I've got some of these mixed seed deli rolls. I got those before and they're really, really nice. Um, so I've got those. Got some brioche buns for the chicken burgers. And then um, I actually ordered the thins, the Warburton cinnamon and raisin, raisin thins, but they subbed them for the normal ones. But that's fine. I mean, I was just trying to save a few calories, but I'll happily eat those. And then some of the Greek flatbreads for our um, chicken meal. So I've got those. And um, these are two of the alcohol-free beers for Yanis. So I've got a tropical IPA and a lager. Um, and they were on an offer by two, save 80p or something. So I think they worked out, I don't know, like 120 each or something. So I got those for him. And then the freezery bits, I got two bags of these chicken poppets. They were on offer. They're normally a pound, which is really cheap, but they were on offer for 75p. Um, they're obviously not the best for you. Um, formed chicken meat. I mean, that doesn't sound the best. But um, they're just for like when we have friends over and just for like quick lunchy picky bits. I'll just bang those in the air fryer for like five minutes. Um, and they'll have those with like some pizza and I'll do some salad and fruit and bits as well. So I've got a couple of, bag of bags of those. I've got a stone baked pepperoni pizza just to be in the freezer again for any friends or whatever that come over. And then I've also got the boys, two lots of lollies were on offer. I think they were two for four pounds. So I've got knobbly bobblies, which Henry chose. And these fruit blaster, which are like rocket lollies that um, Archie chose. And then also an apple strudel for um, pudding on Sunday. And these are in two halves, so that will do two weeks. So that's really good value as well. So that's everything I grabbed from Ocado. And I had a £15 off voucher. So I think it would have been 100 but I got it for 85 something. So I'll pop this, the price on the screen for you. So yeah pleased with that i think i've got a lot for my money and obviously i'm going to use up a bit of meat and stuff from the freezer as well um but um these chicken thighs will do us a couple of dinners um so yeah they were good value as well so i'll just pop it all away and then i will share with you our meal plan for the week Okay, and here is a look at our meal plan. It will be slightly flexible because, like I mentioned, it is Easter holidays and um, we've got some days out. And I've also got a Hello Fresh box um, that is coming on Monday. Um, so a couple of these may well um, stay in the freezer until another time. Um, but this is what I've planned out anyway. So tonight we're going to have spaghetti bolognese with garlic bread. Tomorrow I'm going to use the chicken thighs and the Greek seasoning and do Greek chicken with salad and flatbreads um, and we've got olives and tzatziki so that'll be a really tasty one, that's like one of Yanis's favourites. So we'll have that. Friday I'm going to do some homemade chicken burgers, they'll be kind of like the schnitzels that I did um, and we're going to have those in the brioche buns with some salad and probably some homemade chips. Um, and then Saturday I'm going to do the coconut chicken curry with some rice. Sunday we'll have roast beef and then Monday, like I mentioned, I have actually ordered a HelloFresh box um, because I had £40 credit. So I've got that for like £20 for the five meals. So Monday to Friday next week will be HelloFresh recipes that I'm going to share with you. Um, so I hope you enjoyed seeing a shop from Ocado. Um, it was quite good value with the um, voucher. So um, thanks for watching. And if you haven't already subscribed, please don't forget to hit the button. Um, and I'll be back soon with more foodie videos for you. Take care, everyone. Bye.